Hello YouTube, this is Josh from the Pantech Brothers, and I'm here today going over how to install uh, RetroPie on the Raspberry Pi 3B. So I did the unboxing of the Raspberry Pi uh, basic starter kit from Vilross, and I'm going to walk you through how to go ahead and install RetroPie onto a micro SD card. So first of all, the easiest place to do and go is RetroPie.org.uk. That's the official site for it. Uh, if you go to download, um, if you have a Raspberry Pi 1, uh, you want to use this option. If the Raspberry Pi 2 or 3, download this. And then once you have that, you'll have it downloaded in a .gz uh, compressed file. You want to go ahead and extract that, and you'll end up with this RetroPie.image file. And then you need to download and install a disk imaging software. And I downloaded the uh, Win32 disk imager. That one is um, pretty popular. Go ahead and navigate uh, to the, the image file, select it, and then uh, in the drop down here will be the additional uh, drives. If you have multiple ones that are there, like a USB thumb drives plugged in or external drives, or in this case the micro SD card will show up in this list. Make sure you pick the correct one because it will wipe whatever is on the device that you select. Um, once you've selected that, hit right. A progress bar will come on here and it'll be complete when it's done. And then you're finished. Hit exit. And that is it. Um, I wanted to let you know also of a nice tutorial they have on here on the uh, RetroPie uh, website. If you go to documentation and then installing RetroPie, there and then there's right up here at the top is a first installation link and this will uh, walk you through what you need and the uh, tutorial on how to install it as well so that is all for now uh, our next video will be covering the setup and configuration of RetroPie and the Raspberry Pi itself, um, plugging it in, starting it up, and then we'll cover some more of the tweaks and configuration of RetroPie um, once we get that completed. So I hope you guys found this video helpful. Uh, let me know in the comments below. I will include the links to all these different softwares and websites as well, so you guys can follow them. Uh, and uh, please don't forget to like and subscribe, and we will see you in the next video.